gonna get into this main <coughs> game. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah. Let's... E? What are we doing today? What are we doing? Surprise, that you twat! Between my work with 404 and tracking down you Sky twat. Larson's neural map nightmares, I you thought twat. I could do with a new workspace. I could do with your help as well. I just clocked a hit and run by a black cab. Happened a while ago, but the news ain't picking up on it. What's that got to do with the price of tea? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because all of London's black cabs are driverless, run by AI. Mask. That's the bee the beekeeper. So Deadsec is getting into bed with the coppers now. Whatever happened to lie with dogs, wake up with fleas? I hear you, but this girl's shown she's got a brass pair. She's brass not your typical copper. Balls. Not typical. Your naivete is charming sometimes. Better a bobby than mm. one of those Albion prats. I think our girl may surprise you. And when the fox slaughters all the hens in the coop. I bet you'll be surprised then, too. Yes. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. Oh. Well, yes. 
sort of. This is crazy how now I can't see if people type in chat. That's dope. That is dope. Huh. Right. I know uh -huh. there's something. Might as well pick up the magician here. Let's see. Let's talk about Albion PMC, the only British organization to successfully oppress more of the developing world than the British government, led by Nigel Cass, a man the partisan media calls a charismatic visionary, and Amnesty International calls a war criminal. Albion was given the key to the city to re-establish order following the bombings. Quite fishy, if you ask me. It is. So that's two reasons why we need to find an angle on Cass. We found one. His name? Hamish Bellagi. Born in London, Bellagi was a recipient of the Cass Foundation Technical Scholarship at 14, which included a mentorship with Cass himself. At 16, Bellagi designed Cass's first drone fleet. Fun fact, Cass delayed the launch by a week so it would land on Bellagi's birthday. Cass sounds like Bellagi's second dad. Why would he help us? They had a falling out after an incident in the Niger Delta three years ago. A buried human rights investigation accuses Cass of ordering a drone fleet to wipe out a village protesting the construction of a pipeline, but the drones malfunctioned before they could. Bellagi is named as the likely saboteur. He's been on the run ever since, but now tracking data shows he's reappeared in London. Shit, he's looking for redemption like with the protesters. This guy designed Cass's drone fleet. I think he's trying to disarm Albion. He covers his tracks well, but that's a good guess. Unfortunately, according to this Albion intelligence report, intercepted by our friend Caitlin Lau, Cass knows Bellagi's in London as well. So, that's the op. Make contact with Bellagi before Albion finds him. Then convince him we have a mutual enemy in Cass. So this guy's our best chance to stop Albion and clear our names. And the largest private army on Earth wants him dead. No pressure. No pressure. So basically... It took some doing, but I've narrowed down the area where we're most likely to find Hamish Bellagi. I've pushed the coordinates to your optic. Yeah. It just doesn't even work. Love it. Love it. How are you doing? I hope you don't mind me getting situated in your safe house. Yeah. Crime marches on, and so will I. There are still cases that need to be closed, if you'll help me. Leave it to me. Excellent. I uploaded a case to Bagley. He can brief you on it. sending a ton of crypto to an unknown party in Cairo. Something to do with Kronos X. I believe I've heard of that. Some new dark web party drug, no? It's a highly addictive psychotropic with a staggeringly high fatality rate that stands to make Clan Kelly a lot of money. And Clan Kelly doesn't care about the human cost. Well, the phrase Finsbury New Project keeps popping up in their comms if you'd like to take a look into it. Okay. 
I am getting ready for the purge, bro. This is a purge. This is just gonna happen in real life. This, this is America. I'm going a little weird around here. Two episodes. Is it the darts you enjoy, or is that just something to do with your hands while you get shit faced? Get shit faced. Soccer? Kick tutorial. Alright, let's just say this is physical coordination oh, training. Fuck. I'll keep track of your score. Let's start. Not oh. what I planned. Let's try it again. Oh, okay. Bugger. Shit. Fuck. Welcome to our little family, love. DeadSec is thrilled to have you. I must say, I'm rather looking forward to the experience. Let's go hunt some baddies. Perfect. Let's go smoke some fatties. what I 
Oh shit.
I might have to come back to this fucking tech. This is just annoying. See? Cabs are here. Cabs are here. Right. Auto drive now enabled. Auto drive. Drive now disabled. Oh, it's best to keep on. Keep it on. into Albion's affairs. Oh. Quietly, of course, but I've been able to determine that most of his activity stems from this area. Shall we pop in for a quick hello? Not so fast. Hamish isn't in, according to his home security. And before you get ideas, he's rigged his front door to a series of traps designed to delete all of his data and then your life. Not necessarily in that order. Can you say paranoid? To be fair, you are an armed insurgent trying to break into his flat. Anyway, you should be able to connect to the local grid and use security cameras to disarm his traps. Okay. Here? Oh no. As far as it goes. I believe the main interface is on the rooftop. Bagley, the windows. 
think that's our way in? Sure, if you can get there. Three options here. One, use the window washing platform. Two, find a cargo drone. Three, give up, go home, and resolve to be a better person. I'll give up. On it. Hi, Jack. Let's go. Why did it bounce? Data. Data. Interior decorator, isn't he? Look at all these traps. You could force the traps to unlock by rewiring the power. On it. Welcome to Claire and Present Danger, and welcome to Fascist London. Oh. Don't let that boot on the back of your neck disturb you. In time, you'll barely feel it. We have to wake up, people. If there was a playbook for setting up a totalitarian police state, Albion would be most of the way through it and working on the epilogue. They certainly took advantage of the fallout from the bombings, didn't they? They preyed on the fears of the city government, too. They were only too happy to hand Nigel Cass the keys to the city. Wash the hands to the whole mess. Oh, yeah. The collar will only get tighter now, friends, unless we do something. We can't wait for someone else to fight back. We are the change.
Well. That's weird. Yeah. He had his front door rigged with a shotgun. Love it. Okay, let me, uh, <clears throat> I'm doing this wrong. Traps are disarmed. Now, if you go through the front door of the flat, it's much less likely you'll be killed. That's all nice. <clears throat> Open the hair. Oh, can I jump in the water? Change that there. Uh, oh, so you can. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Chief and I'll blow the whole place with you in it. Okay, no need to get excited. Who the fuck are you? And what are you doing in my flat? You with Albion? Hardly. More like the exact opposite. What, dead sick? Yeah, right, and I'm Che Guevara. You're done. Please don't! We're here to warn you. Albion knows you're in London. You have to run. Fuck me. You're telling the truth, aren't you? <sighs> Fucking hell, thought I was careful. Fucking idiot, Amish! Look, Cass is worse than you know. Oh, we know. Why the hell else would I be out here risking my neck? Maybe, because Nigel Cass is paying you. 
That's how fucking mercs work. Oh, please. We're on the same side. Cass already tried to kill us once, and we know he had a hand in the bombings. Mate, you don't know shit. You have no idea what Cass is and what... Move, move, oh, move! Fuck! An Albion squad's closing in on you. I guess you weren't lying about that part. Fuck. <laughs> think, Amy. Think. Shit, fine. We'll table it. I'll buy you some time. Just go. No! Run! Move it! Move it! Red Forest! Don't just stand there. Albion won't be fussy about who they shoot. Phelps, I'll fucking tell you that. Jesus. Chief, that was a pretty slick escape. I believe you. So I'll say this. Nigel is planning something, and I don't think I could stop him on my own. If dead sex everything I've heard, you'll help me. We can help each other. There's a chance Cass had something to do with the bombings. What could he be planning that's worse than that? No, no, that's not like him. Well, not exactly. <clears throat> see, Nigel's got to see himself as the hero. He's an arrogant twat, but he's not a cynic. <clears throat> Every place we go into, he... we would have some mad plan to fix all his problems. With robot police or automated crop fertilizing or some shit. Society was a technical problem. And people are just bugs in the software, you know? You work around them or you squash them. Sorry, Chief. I've got to switch proxy servers so they don't trace me. I'll hit you right back on voice. Listen, I've got an inside man, right? A contact in Albion. Says Nigel's got this big meeting happening at White Tower. He'll be talking about a major project he's got planned for London. Working on an upgrade of his private police. Sky missions. I can probably do this guy here. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, my mum will love this. Dear God, my eyes. Bagley! Zip up, get to work, and let's never talk about this again. Yeah, 
one sec. I'm trying to set something up here. Give me one second. But I don't see it working. I'm trying to add a scene here and go. I don't think this is it though. That's not it. Here. Uh, 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 uh. Trying to add a scene. How do you add a scene again? It's a media file. Yes. Okay. Add source. But I already. No, that's not what I. Transition. First of all, I gotta fucking find it. You know what? I'll do this later. Whatever. Whatevs. Come on, pretty boy. Fam. You lot certainly know how to pick your targets. You do know that Albion have set up their headquarters in there, right? Yo, since when do we answer to you? Cass got some big meeting about his new project. This whole city's gonna be fucked if we don't stop him. Do you get that? Fucking Nigel Cass. You're right. Nothing good can come of this. Luckily, I hear loads of sob stories working in a pub. And near this place, quite a few from Albion are dissatisfied with the status quo. You turn on the charm, and I'm sure you can get one to join the good guys. Even got a candidate in mind. Interesting. Ping me with that personal info. I'll have Bagley push it along. Good luck, love. Bagley. Who would who would look at their kids and just name them Bagley? That's it's like almost an insult. It's like Bagley Smith. Sounds like a bag of chips. I don't know. Just disgusting. Recruit? Oh, I have to recruit him? Oh, recruit. Guard. Oh. It's just a guy pushing a bro. What was that? I'm taking you! I 
Is this how I go? You must be joking. This just takes a while. Alright, let's stand not in the direction of the fucking guns. He's working into the... What should we do today?
Self-driving rubbish. That's creepy. This is what Oh, hi. On. Are you with... Oh, how do I put this? I recently reached out to some people who... Oh, fuck. This is impossible. Calm the fuck down. I'm with dead sick. Shite. That's a relief. Shite. Can't be too careful, right? With them Albion wankers. But you... I don't know if you understand how much people appreciate what you've done in Southwark. Cheers. We'll get this. I've done a little bit of hacking myself, right? Real quiet. Don't dig too deep where they might have caught on, but guess what I found? Albion's Global Information Centre is right here in London. Global! You understand? Everything's run out of there. Coordinated, like, operations. It. Need of assistance to resume patrol. Over. This is a huge opportunity to really stick it to Albion. Not just here, but everywhere they operate. Everywhere they're stomping That's on human it. rights. The server floor is accessed by elevator. Seeing how this is pretty much Albion's global war room, expect heavy security. This floor just pushed me. Seriously? Yeah. Push me again. This is absolutely great. To my regards to your mum. Yeah. Yes! There is a god! Welcome to Nexus Tower. Huh. No. Do I need a construction worker? Because I cannot call. Get down, you fuck!
still don't have the fucking key though. This is the... Oh, I can't change? Because oh. I'm in a mission already. Fuck. Move it to last known position. Where the hell did you go? The mom's house. Begin searching. And no human zone, how refreshing, so clean, so organized, so peaceful. They follow strict environmental controls in the server silos. Luckily, you can take control over the maintenance drones. The easiest way to completely scramble their information center would be to cause a surge in the power core. So what do we do? They use high capacity battery banks to ensure backup power. If you can find one, simply drop it in the core and that'll do it. 
I'll see what I can turn up. This battery bank in the core and Albion logistics, done. Tactical assessment, kaput. Whatever operational algorithms they rely on, all gone. Get to it.
Fucking stuck.
Battle core. Okay, I can do that. Not an if, but I get to the fucking power core. things.
<laughs> sure. That's it. Drop this battery bank in the core and Albion Logistics, done. Tactical assessment, kaput. Whatever operational algorithms they rely on, all gone. Get to it. Albion's Global Information Center. How about we let the people of Southwark know? I have an idea. Let's get out of here.
everyone in this bloody borough saw that, they'll rise up for sure. Add this to everything else you've done in Southwark. The people are gonna back you, dead sec. And so am I. You can call on me if you think I can be of help. Anytime. Cheers. Pleasure. Don't be surprised if we ask you for help in return one day. Fucking brilliant. The news that Albion's Global Operations Center is out of commission is bound to get people thinking that things are on the outs for Albion. You did well. Cheers. Fuck yes, dead sec just keeps getting stronger. Welcome to the resistance, mate. I'm happy to be here. Now, let's get to it. Fantastic. May even have a new recruit. Ready? jacket. Code is amateurish, crammed in there like a pack of crayons in a dim child's nose. There's even a comment attached to the code. What does it say? No words, just bit strings. Gibberish, and not enough of it to compile any useful data. You're saying a hacker's controlling the black cubs and using them to murder heads? Exactly, but I need more data to be sure. Right. Well, we'd best look for more cabs that are operating. If we get the bit strings, we can find out who the hacker is and where they're located.
on up on this guy. Lower it. Strings in a comment. I'll try converting them. Don't run we ask. Let us. What was that? So these bit strings came from an audio file and not, as I suspected, from someone kicking their keyboard down a spiral staircase. Hack another cab and I can decode the rest. Aria! Yeah, Who knows how many murders those taxi cabs will come in? I now have enough bit strings to complete the audio file. Let's see. With all due respect, these are broker tech employees, your employees being run over by your product. Don't you want what's best for your employees? Sky Larson knows full well what is best for her employees, Lieutenant, and that is why the black cabs will remain operational. But surely taking the cabs offline wouldn't affect your bottom line? All we ask is for Albion's cooperation as we resolve the situation internally. Let us worry about our bottom line. What? A broker tech product is killing its own workers. I've gone over all the victims of black cabicide and they all have two things in common. Yeah, Very poor reflexes and their employer, Broker Tech. So is this another one of Sky Larson's neural mapped victims? That's right, a former cabbie. Broker Tech partnered with the city to automate their cabs and now the cabs are getting their revenge. And it's up to us to stop this madness. What can we do? We still need to find this AI's location. Hack into another cab and I'll see if it has a readable user history. Download complete. It appears the code alterations have been coming from a parking garage in Westminster. Parking garage. I don't fancy bailing out those broker tech corporate twats, but even I can't pin this on them. This is Sky Larson's own brand of evil. The creator-creation relationship could be a dark and complex thing. See Frankenstein, bride of Frankenstein, son of Frankenstein. Right, funny guy. Not what London needs. Anyway, shutting down murderous AI is what I signed up for. more good people. It takes a brass pair to stand up for what's right. Damn right. Man's ready to tear it up. Brilliant. We don't need you here. Hmm. 
you have arrived at the Black Cat parking garage and repair facility. We're here to find that AI and get it to stop plotting GPS routes through Broker Tech employees. Sec and we'll call it even. Sound good? All right, mate. Come in. Clear. Gonna keep searching.
Huh. Oh, there it is. Check it elsewhere. Oh, here it is. Fuck me! Shit! 
immediately started again. They must have reverted to an older backup system. Initial reports indicate that they've lost their killer instinct. Do you think the AI was trying to kill Sky Larson? Was that its ultimate goal? I'd want revenge too, but I'd like to think I'd be smarter about it. We did what we had to do. Mission complete. See, see. I you said Starbucks and yeah, I want some. I love you. You know, you remember. You remember. Sure, exactly. Grandy. No, I want the I want the big tall one. 
<laughs> that was hilarious. Sure. That. Okay. Take me anywhere. What did this guy? Oh. oh. Oh, come on. Let's get up in there. on a 10.33. Advise conditions. If that's the same thing I need to do this one. I could go higher. Oh, another one.
So that's what it is. I gotta throw it up there. I, obviously, I can't get up there. Next mission. Operative. There's another dog named Brandy. M.I.A. Oh, sick! Good to have you, blood. That sex's gonna be unstoppable now. Yes, I'm so ready to help out the cause. Oh, oh yeah. Bro. Oh yeah. Taken the liberty of perusing the shipping manifests, Clan Kelly took possession of three crates originating from Cairo. Probably crates of Kronos X. We destroy the crates, then Clan Kelly doesn't have anything to sell. 
about that. The crates have some kind of trap mechanism that releases nerve gas when tampered with. Surprisingly creative security measure. Normally they rely on burly lads with sacks of doorknobs. Of course they're rigged. I'll just have to be careful. I swear to God, I ran. Drone, search around here. Not finding any animal. You're gonna move on. Are there no traps? Come out and play with me. What do I do here? Supply is taken care of, but the supply line is still functional. I can help with that. 
Clan Kelly gets their Kronos X out of Cairo through a broker. Abby Tran. I found out through an informant that she accompanied the latest shipment. Then we might be able to find her at the shipyard. We need to keep that rubbish off the streets. Rubbish. This is the shipyard where Clan Kelly received the Kronos X. Time to find Abby Tran and make sure she doesn't broker any more. A smuggler. Let's take the smuggler. You'll fit right in. The more people willing to fight the system, the better. Banging! I'm gassed. When do we start bashing heads in? Brill. You should be able to find Abby Tran somewhere nearby.
not supposed to be scared. Spider crawling. I'm Spider Man. Can I cross here? Time to put an end to Abby Trans dealings with Clan Kelly. Take her out. Take her out. drug shipments in that state. Great work. Kronos X was on the verge of becoming a huge problem. You've saved lives by keeping it off the streets. Plus, we fucked up Clan Kelly's plans by cutting them off from their supplier. So there's that. We are not done by a long shot. But this is a step in the right direction. Sugar. 
Yeah, it's like this puppy German Shepherd, and those things are no joke. It's a puppy though? Yeah, it's freaking trying to attack me. How big? Like... They grow, they grow big. Like here. It's a little puppy. They, I know they grow big. Those, those dogs are gonna get shed like a motherfucker. Because I remember they called me after, hey, this dog jumped uh, aggressively on my uncle, blah, 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 blah. He came to visit. I was like, he, the dog doesn't even know you. You got to, like, ease him into, you know, strangers. Yeah. She was like, oh, that makes sense. That's right. I was like, was he aggressive? Like I said, was he aggressive when your kids came out and they were playing with him when they first met him and you were standing there? He was like, no. I go, so then... You got a stranger going into your yard where he's trying to protect his him, his area, and then she's like, oh, "Okay." She never called me again. I didn't know that. Oh yeah. And what she say? Your dog. <laughs> she said my dog. Yeah, my dog. It's like, <laughs> like I just your gave it. Dog. I was like, "Ma'am, I just gave it to you." Yeah. Yeah, I, I wish I shouldn't. I should have kept that fucking dog. Yeah, I wish you did. But that dog, his or her name is Ari. Ari. Yeah, and she. They were like, give her a piece of meat, give her a piece of meat. And I'm like, <laughs> holding it out with my my fingers. And then it, she bit my thumb. And then I gave her, an, I threw her another gotta, piece of meat. Because you got to like, put her. it on your palm. No, dad, that dog was going to bite me. <laughs> or drop it in his mouth. That's what I did the second time. I was just kind of like, yeah. here. But I was scared. I was really scared. That's the same thing that happened. Are those with, guys out there or no? Yeah, but they're like down they, the they painted the front? Yeah. Except for the door. Except for the door. Yeah. Uh, the back. It's gonna take a whole nother day, bro. <laughs> I mean, they get probably paid by the day, so, so I mean, they, for them, they gotta let's fucking drag it out. Yeah. But that's what happened with freaking Adriana's dog. Yeah. Can you, like, come over here more? Not that I'm gonna stare at you, but at least, you know, I scratch you on my peripherals. But yeah, that's the same thing with happening with Adriana's dog. Yeah, two German shepherds, probably full round. And I came over and I walked in and they're like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, and I'm like literally just like scratching up, like, going like that. I'm like, what am I supposed to do? Not act scared? That's impossible. Keep calm. Let them show dominance as they did. It was so scary. But I did meet their other dog as well. Hades. It's like this giant poodle. I like that. Yeah. This is black. A poodle. Softest thing. Softest dog I've ever touched, probably. No. The little puppy. It literally was cuddling me and putting his neck like. Like in my my shoulder and stuff, mm -hmm. and I'm like, hmm. but it was so cute, Dad. I need to take a picture, or maybe Taylor has a picture. But yeah, so cute. I all of a sudden, Ethan has, has oh, found the love for pugs. There's somebody who lives here has a pug. Oh yeah. He's like, oh my god, a pug! I yeah. want a pug. I'm like, huh? He's, he's always like pugs, no? Let me grab my drink. No. I don't know. Did I get any mask? Look at that shit. Oh, look at that. I like it, eh? Oh. Ooh, Taylor canceled. Phew! <laughs> what do you mean? Hmm? What do you mean? 
What do I need? Shoot, what do you mean? She, she, she flaked. Oh, because. Because oh. she has to work later on today, anyways. But she was like, we can still hang out for a little bit. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> I mean, shoot, I need, to, I need to go get my eyebrows done, so we can go get our eyebrows done. Yeah. Just, you know, just because. And then she was like, okay, and then I got work at, and then I was like, okay. Where does she work? Mm. Oh, McDonald's? Which one? The one next to the Arco. I know it's not, it's like... The one next to the Arco gas station, and then the Sonic. Mm. Yeah, over there. I don't know what street that's called. I know it's gray, and then... It's 20. It's highway, it's highway 20. Highway 20. Calusa Highway. But yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay, fight plan. Let's go fight some people. Let's go fight some people. Oh, then you gotta take a picture of something. That's evidence. Oh, I can fast travel, right? Hey, you see, well, it's actually been nice to me lately. <laughs> She's the only woman that can make me happy. But that's not that's not what what I mean. They put y'all together because of me. They want me to be bored, so Hey, who's they? Oh. They you think there's more than one? <laughs> they them. <laughs> they them, oh, okay, okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. Same game. It's like the same game. Okay. <laughs> the same game. Where the guy's ball and he has a mark on his head. Look at this guy. Nasty oh, no, no that Hitman? that's Hitman. Back off me. Back off me. Get out of here. What? Are you trying to hit a girl? <laughs> oh shit. Wait, are you a I'm a girl. Like no, it's pretty good. Yeah. Like a little juice. Yeah, that's, 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 that's good. Is it up there from here? Am I in the wrong building? Huh? Am I in the wrong building? I can't get. I can't get to the window. Oh, there it is. Oh, fuck, she turned it off. Oh. 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 
she does. She has a like a like a taser type gun. Oh, this guy. Oh. Pina Calara. I think I would need to go. I need to go to Hawaii and get some more pineapple, man. Really? Yeah. I don't think I've ever eaten that much fruit in meat. That's what I'm saying. Me, me too. We should, we should go to Rayleigh's. Get some uh, fruit or something. Can I? Because honestly, yeah. Oh, I wish I had this ages ago. Country, you're buying fruit. I'm going to skip for you. But it's simple. How do I get up here? Oh yeah, Taylor made, the reason why I went over was because Taylor was making food. Oh. And she told me. It was like Ooh. this, it was like this pork stir fryer. Cook it stir fried and chicken from the kitchen. But she like pointed out the stuff that could have made, made it better, which I did she felt like the meat was connected to chicken too long. Then we could have cooked the rice for a little bit longer, but the overall flavor, pretty good. Fire. Waiting area crime report. Mm. Right then, there's no time to chit chat. Oh no. I'll be in a synchronized their teams. This is tough. I'll feed you the locations as I oh, get them. You tough. take them down. Well, go on. You're destroyed. wasting time. This drone has been modified slightly oh, faster with tough. better armor, but its maximum altitude is restricted. Right. Also, Albion is using too. CTOS to monitor the borough. They could shut it down if you fly okay. too high. Time to buzz the streets. All right. Come on, light. Get out of my way. Oh, I missed it. That looks like a bloody good nice. time. But don't oh, dilly dally. To the next one before they launch their range. Oh, look sharp, you've got Albion drones heading your way. Come on! Yeah, well, they have other drones. This guy. I've tried to do this mission like several times and I just failed. Get moving. What? 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 Well done, but no time to wait. Well done! Then the drone, this drone is like weak, so it's not like... Take a lot of... Fire. fire. I can't fly too high, because then... Oh, there's more. There's more. No, that, I mean that's that's in a sense how we live. I remember one of the that the Grassi and even Elon Musk that, that us we cannot fly off the earth basically because we have a, a barrier, a firmament, like like the Bible says, which is like a kind of like a. Come on, recharge. Spread out. Yes, one more should do it. What? This is bloody British. Son of a really? <laughs> I'll run up and then maybe, maybe you're a good looking. I've never gotten this far. Always got it shot down. Oh! Yes, a firmament, which is like a, a bubble. That's, how, that's where we live, because our atmosphere is in this supposed bubble. We cannot break it. I'll flush out. There is a scientific area. Right. Is that what the Yes, well, it's under the cold. I don't know. 
the last of it. Well, yeah. Nice. High five. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. That, but then look, these are the pictures that has Taylor sent me. That's a poodle. Yeah. That's that's a, I wouldn't say it's no damn Jebber Shepherd. No, no, no. That's not the dog that attacked me. This yeah. is the one that was super nice. A raid like that would have broken our spirit. Turn the borough into Albion bootlickers. You showed some grit hey, there, walk, love. Tattoo my head. You asked me, no. you could have earned this shit yourself. On. This old bird still has some pluck in her, like... and so does this <laughs> neighborhood, thanks to you. Trust. So I'm hyped this, to take on Albion. This is what I told Good to know there are people like you who got our backs. Well said. Goodbye, dear, and stay in touch. Easy times create weak men. Easy times Sounds create like Hackney and Islington are ready to rise up and defy us. Weak men create tough times. My grandfather walked 10 miles to work every day. My father walked five. I'm driving a Cadillac. <laughs> My son is in a Mercedes. He said my grandson will be in a Ferrari. But he said my great grandson will be walking again. So I asked him, I said, well, why is that? And he said to me, tough times create strong men. Strong men create easy times. Easy times create weak men. Weak men create tough times. He said to me, many will not understand, but you have to raise words. Easy times. So I tell him, I said, I said what, did, what did you get out of that? And I go, he goes, what do you mean? He said, explain it to me. If you understood it, explain it to me what you think. Then he said some off the wall shit like, um, I forgot, I even forgot what he said. Okay. Something that had us, I said, I said, no, it means, you know, because I because I create easy times, you know, my next generation make if I make it easier for them. You know, I went through my struggle in my life, and now I've made my children live in the easier, in the e a little easier. He goes, okay, so I'm a gardener then. <laughs> See you later. I'm a gardener. <laughs> you know, this the, is a saying that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that that is it, it, is better to have a, a a warrior in a garden than a garden in a war. A gardener in a war. Oh. Yeah. I'm a gardener. Then. <laughs> so I'm a gardener. Could have asked for a better result then, Zach. Well, Fuck yeah. Not freaking say some off the walls. <laughs> <laughs> he says some one. So I I I wish I remember what he said. He was he was pretty pretty crazy. <laughs> You're like, okay, so not that. Okay, but. it's like, no, not nothing to do with that. It's like, you know, easy times. And it's, and it's the truth. Welcome to Dead Tech, fam. Yeah. We're getting smarter, right. faster, but and my madder dad made every it easy day. For me. Fuck yeah. Well, my parents Let's made it easy for fuss, me. Let's shall we? Sick. In a, in a way, until I made it tough for myself. It's like, no, I don't want to live with you. I want to go pay rent. And struggle and starve. Stand down, mate. Fuck. I can't believe I did that. I can't believe it. Dad. I really if that, if that were me, I would have stayed with that. Yeah. So would I. We're being contacted by our potential recruit. I Passing them through now. Seriously. If you want my help, why, he, why yeah, can't I fight thoughts. this guy? He's punching me in the face. Just join us, will ya? Seriously, we I... Need people like I... You. What do you say? I was okay, like, yes, I didn't think. Mm, that's not good. But at, at the same time, I did not want to be a burden to them. 
you know, in a, in a sense. Not that it would, I would have been a burden, but I think in my mind, like, you know, I, I, you know, I wanted to kind of prove myself that I was uh, an adult. I, I, I don't know. Dude, believe me, I, I stayed in Puerto Rico three fucking months. And I was like, oh, this is nice, but it's me. But I, I was afraid to go walk into to get a job, go, go walk into this foreign country to me. My Spanish, my Spanish was horrible, mm. worse than what it is now. I mean, like horrible. Actually, kind of like yours. And for me to go into these businesses and try <laughs> to ask for a job, yes, I had a car. Yo quiero un trabajo. <laughs> you know, I'm I'm American, and then you know I barely speak Spanish, and you know, yeah. so I was afraid of that. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it, 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 and I was like, no, no, no. I know New York. I can. I can go do something. I can go back to the job I had or whatever. Mm. Which was doing the tire thing. Um, which was very stupid of me. Very, very stupid of me. And, um... Yeah. Jesus Christ, yeah. he wants too much to go down right now. It was very, very... very dumb of me to do. Correct. It truly, truly was. But it made me who I am today. You know, without that, without that, why can I not go to the store? Okay, I'm racist. You know, if it wasn't for that, you know, you know who knows? Who knows? I mean, you guys, I mean, you guys still would have been born. God, I definitely would have found another wife, Puerto Rico, blah blah blah, 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 blah and I would have. You know, I would have found a couple of them. But. But, you know, it just, I don't know, would have been different. I would have been there when my dad passed. Oof, that would have killed me, probably. More than it. In a sense, in a sense, I wish I would have talked to him before he passed. But there was a time where he... I was on the phone, I was like, ah, I don't want to talk because I'm, you know, I'm fucking drunk or whatever I was. I was drunk and... Why can't I... Is this guy not a fucking fighter? What the fuck? Does he not throw punches? Okay, you, you're, you're garbage. You're garbage. I gotta get rid of this guy. Literally, he literally doesn't throw any punches. Okay, I don't, I don't need that. Um, so yeah, it was something like that. Mm. What is that? What is what? Um. Yeah, yeah. Because I remember, I went to a party, and I got totally wasted, and. Uh, I was really bad. And you know, I think I was in Juno's house at that time. And it was like, yeah, I think it was like almost I'm Brandon's up baby they shower. The deadlock on that Brandon's, artifact. You know, One more shot of redemption, baby perhaps? shower, which is Brandon from Brandon. I think it was that party. I just drank way really too much. And yeah, he called. He was talking to my mother. And then I. I I think I talked to her for a few minutes. She's like, hey, you want to talk to your dad for a few minutes? Because we rarely talked on the phone. Rarely. Mm. We didn't have a huge communication between us. I'm hacking systems. What do you mean, what's the point of the game? I'm hacking the system, taking over control of sections, building a hacking team. And taking over sections. Why don't you have your mic on? Or your camera? Nah, just uh, nah, I don't feel like it. I'm picking my nose. Because I didn't want nobody to see it. So, yeah, so. my toenails. So, yeah, so because I was like, wasn't feeling good, and she was like, hey, maybe put your dad on, talk to your dad. Because she's kind of like, almost like, not forced, but always say, hey, go talk to your dad. Mm -hmm. Talk to your dad on the phone. And I was like, no, 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 I'm not feeling good. And then like the, I think it was like the next day, 
Mm. I think he passed, or the, the neck, or the or two days later, something like that. So, Jeez. Uh, but I, you know, in a, in a sense, I knew he was proud of me. What? Just kind of met your mother. Oh, there it is. Yeah, this is right here. Oh, that's a long camera. It's not, not gonna take me outside. Oh, maybe. Alright, nope. Definitely not a welcoming vibe here. Need to hit download again? Oh. Come on. Start downloading. Yeah, they want, they want you to freaking touch his toes, man. I know. <laughs> um. Well, if you hop the little thing. I'm gonna puke. I don't want him to see me, because then it just defeats the... Oh, right there, right there. Literally, it's... Literally! Oh. <laughs> okay, this is what I was trying to avoid. I got, I got, I downloaded it. Jesus, oh wait. Now I got a murky, bro. You can set traps and shit. Damn. I was, I was trying to avoid the violence. <laughs> But, but to think, you know, I, I, uh, I was 21, but to, to think, I mean, obviously I'm here with you guys. My dad taught it, you know, later in life to have kids with my mother, because he was uh, old with my mother, but imagine right now, I'm not here. That's how I was in this, in this scenario. So yeah, it's just you know, obviously different, just different times where different areas. Your eyes open. They could be anywhere. But yeah. Drone, initiate search I protocol. That life lesson from my dad, but he was not here, so it was tough. Wait, oh my God! Please don't see me. <laughs> I got you. No, I. I see a lot of people like, on social media like cope with like making jokes about it. And they're like, oh no. sorry, I was just thinking about my dad. Do you I mean what what up I mean to be honest with you, I mean life life goes on. I mean you know it truly is uh, there's nothing that stops it. Oh, now he comes out, really? Really? I don't think he's up here. Hey, uh, Unlock some shit. But definitely it was tough. Then I remember, uh, you know, Junior, your uncle, 
calling everybody and telling people who just didn't know that he had passed and I was sitting next to him and I'm like every time he's like hey calling everybody hey you know he passed oh he passed he passed I was like would you shut the fuck up or some shit like that I was just like I gotta fucking hear this every, every fucking five minutes and I just fucking left the house and yeah yeah it was crazy and then your mother was not very consoling called her and uh, yeah it was bad and I went over there I had fucking I was broke I think all I paid for all I could I could pay for was like my ticket I, had, I couldn't pay for the fucking cab that we the, we, had, we took a van with like eight of us I was broken and shit, you know. Why did I even pay for my ticket? I don't even remember. Maybe Tony paid for it? Or Dez? I, I told you, but I don't remember. It was like all a blur. All a blur. And something that, like I said, I will never, never forget. And, I, and then when I get to the house, I my whole body gave out and I fell in front of the house. And I could not get up. I was probably there on my, on my just sitting like this, crouched for like maybe an hour. I could not move. No. Never forget. What is this? What is this? Hey, uh, okay. life lesson, man. Is there no people here? Is the life lesson that you just appreciate the people around you or what? Well, you try to. No, the point is, you, 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 the thing is to the thing to do is to spend time with the people that you love. Lucas, I know you have this bright idea about how truth, our ancestors single-handedly saved know, London I, from the Templars before. The whole so why is, can't we you know, do it again? Don't cry. I mean, people but say, "Don't cry when I die." Story, isn't there? It's like they had don't a come whole see me gang on, on my dead body. Come and join help me from another assassin. We're alive. Some of the Share most some brilliant together. people ever born with their allies, and our ancestors still have a tough time fighting. You're dead, don't matter fighting. anymore. It's done. Just a, just we a, don't have anybody. Uh, just the two of body. us. You know, soul's Not gone. that I'm saying I'm helping you on this mad quest, but still, I've made my point. Can I not break this? Our ancestors were nearly killed many times over. We could be killed just as easily. The device is ours. Oh, look at this. I'll get you. But on another note... Not quite done yet. There's another piece of this. <laughs> when do you even start talking about <laughs> I don't know. Oh, when I was talking about Ethan. And then for like, Ethan, it's tough. Because I got so used to being around you, you two. Mm. Sometimes I don't know what the hell to do with them. I want to get out of here. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Oh! That's not very nice. Okay, fuck. Oh. Where's the store at? 
This guy looks homeless. Where is the Gucci store? I'm, oh, there it is right there. Can I? Oh no. Sometimes I think, since, you know, I'm not in a rush to move out, well, anymore, because I did go through a phase where all I could think about was moving out. <laughs> but now that I'm not in a rush, and I think, like, if I were to, if I were sure thing, to get pregnant, <laughs> oh my goodness. If I were. Oh I'm not goodness. saying I'm trying to or oh I'm, I'm going to. I'm just saying. I'm speaking out loud. Oh my goodness. I'd be fine. Oh god. No, you wouldn't. You would not be fine. Why? Uh, because you would put the burden on me. Okay, but then once that baby's freaking born, you're going to be all over it. Maybe. Exactly. So Maybe. Same thing if Kayla were to have a Maybe. baby right now. Maybe. Maybe. What if I don't like it? You don't like it, Red. What if I don't like it? That's um. It's gonna be a little mini me. I say, get fuck out of here, bruh. Oh, look, look at this. I like that matching uh, little suit thing here. Yeah, get rid of the glasses. That's just shades, bro. I need, I need to get him a different hat. Oh god, look at this. Oh, okay. oh, little beret. What do you think, little beret? Mm. Oh. <laughs> How about that one? A little bow on the side, a little beanie. Oh god, I don't want one of those. I want the beanie. Sure. Did they, you gotta change the shirt. Did I not change it? I thought I did. Yeah. <laughs> right there. And then it's pants. You don't. What's wrong with his pants? You see, every time you go to change something, it oh, goes it. back to that other thing. Just get the standard black pants. You don't like style, little flare? You don't like a little flare? How about what? Oh, how about mustard? What is this? <laughs> mustard. Okay. Dad, do you realize when we say literally? Oh, right there. Yeah. When I have say, to hold. I'll press it. Hold. When you say literally, you say literally. <laughs> literally. <laughs> literally. Looks like the freaking blood's coming with the, how long those pants are. Damn, you're just <laughs> killing this guy, dude. I can give him some new glasses. There you go. Is no app. Huh? Is no, is no glasses an option? Uh, I've been stuttering so bad lately. It's ridiculous. Yeah? I almost swore at work. And I even mean, I didn't even mean to say it. <laughs> You know what? I like these. I make these look good. He say he makes these look good. Sure. Okay, I need to go. Desmo. That's a that's an inside shirt. Inner shirt. How about? Desomo. Huh? Des. Desomen. Desomen delay. Come on. Desomen delay. Okay. It took me a second, right? I was like. I know you've been. I know you've been out of school a while. I know you've been out of school for a long time. I'm right here, like this. <laughs> no. I, I already bought it. Bruh. What else? This little fancy. I'm a fancy boy. Absolutely. No. <laughs> You're not helping here. Okay, go up. That little vest. Go up. This? Yeah, that's cool. It looks like, it looks like a biker. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> All right, I think we're done. Hey, he looks good. That's uh, there we go. He just looked homeless before. All right, what are you looking at? Drink your coffee. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to go in there. You don't like where this is going? Oh, that's right, you can't hear it. <laughs> uh, I'm supposed to get in the cage. What am I doing in here? No, I'm not supposed to get in there. Where am I going again? Oh, right there. Let's take a car. Where's the cab at? Cab! Cab's here! All right. Electric cabs. No, no driver. Well, now I'm driving. No, it's on, remember, this is in uh, England or whatever. 
no way. Auto drive now enabled. I am on the left side. Oh, yeah, listen to the music. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I Wait, am I to this way? I'm at already? What the? What is this? Get oh, pierced? This is... <laughs> Get pierced? Is that what that, did? that said? No, it says safe house. Where did you see something? I am so gone. Actually, let me just. This is where I want to go. And it's like, okay. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> oh, yeah. My coworkers in Jamaica right now, probably. Jamaica? Yeah. AI took my job. That's gonna be neighbor. That's. It's coming. But, um, it's gonna go back to Starbucks. It's gonna be not all particulars, but like these are the way we make the drinks, and you cannot mix and match. It's not, you can't like make it your own. And machines are gonna start making it. It won't be probably won't be as good, but they'll 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 get up they'll perfect it. Look at this guy, a little harmonica. The machine, right? And the AI will be like the the soup Nazi. One year, get out. No service. No coffee for you. What I gotta do here? Access granted. Download. 404 contracts. Okay. Destroy civilian. Civilians. Surveillance tech. Civilians. Okay. You gotta destroy the civilians of the. Yeah. <laughs> Surveillance. <laughs> you know, you know, you remember. I could be this girl. What's this girl? She is a scouting mission. She's Fan. a professional hitman. Fan Chuan. Yeah. Chuan. I can. She's closer. So I'm sorry, so let me go to her. She's a hitman. And they all have different jobs and different equipment they can use and different skills. Well. Turns out I wasn't haunted. But right, where was I? If you want to join... Quick, Albion is about to blow up London Bridge. Just... Nah, you for real? Well, not yet. I... Er, next time... I mean, she has so many of them. Wait, wait, wait. So many that she blows up. Just get a dog, any dog. Get the stuff. Quick jump. You can <laughs> Suck. Look at this. Look, I'll go backwards, bro. I'm. She's freaking. What's it called? What's it called? A dumbass. <laughs> That's what she is. Let me go to this sneaker designer. No, I meant like those people that like spin on their heads or what is that called? A break dancer? Yeah, she's break dancing. Well, she's she's an idiot. <laughs> Been needing talent like you, cuz. Oh, Glad come on. Oh, it should be stuck now. Did she just try to hit you? No, no, no. <laughs> but this is... This is crazy. How far am I now? Fuck. This corner. Let's go. Get out, bruh. Oh. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> Let's get there alive. 
Oh my goodness! I guess I'm not supposed to park there. You're done. Come on, par partial fox, <laughs> you fuck. This is the place. This is the place. Okay. Come on. So, like the helmets and stuff, they're just disguised. Well, no, yeah, yeah, because when you go into the missions, the red, the red part, they put on their disguise. Anyway. Oh wait, but I need to hack the system. Oh, this is it. Are they gone from outside? Can you check? I think so. Cause it's already two thirty. I'll be our all bike. B R B. Right about now. Oh, so brother. Oh. Yeah, they're gone, but they still got all their stuff up there. Like all their vans and ladders and stuff. I don't know. I don't know where they are. That is the call button. Oh, so brother. Oh, so brother.
Show me the way. Oops, that's wrong. Turn off your mic. Turn off my mic. Yeah. And he's always positive. He's always posting up at the gym. And there's always just someone there hating on him. Doesn't matter who. Mm. And he like never. Destroying other people's property thing. It's easy to hate. Destroyed. Target destroyed. <laughs> oh. I feel like if I live somewhere like New York where everybody's like uh, on you, bruh. Well, not New York, people say uh, people are rude, but uh, I don't think they're that rude. It all depends. Oh, fuck. Did you? Ah! Oh! Oh, we can load it on. <laughs> you saw that? He was falling. He was like, oh no. Really 
Yes. Do I group? Uh, and I grew up in Brooklyn. Let's get this little shit. Tough. And you have kind of a jerk. Mm. But, you know, or you get people that just walk on you? Yep. Sometimes I work, I just. <clears throat> I was intimidating so people just don't They like don't even have the thought. They're like, oh no, not Trails got cold. Let's regroup. Resting victories. <laughs> I have resting sad face for it. <laughs> people we'll just, just think I'm sad all the time. People just <laughs> I just feel sorry for you. Yeah, they're like Different times, I'm out of this mission. Oh. What's next? Mm.
Excellent. Our little posse's going out. Welcome to Dead Sec. Welcome to Dead Sec. the place. Time to do that. your destroying other people's like, property thing. So many orders and just everything. I'm charging like a hundred dollars for like a sweatsuit. That's not bad. And then he, other popular people were promoting it and promoting it and promoting that. And they just kept going and going. And then the popular people were starting to wear it. I guess I'm gonna do that for my t-shirts. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty inexpensive, I think. Um, hundred bucks for a suit. I thought that that, that can't be it. It says like the original price is one twenty, and then it, it's crossed out and then it's one hundred. I thought you'd just smash it to bits, but you smash the bits to bits. You just came in here to charge your phone, huh? Oh, there it is. Well, I'll go back. This girl is in a 
TikToker. Pretty sure she's very popular. And she posted recently about these girls like sit who were sitting behind her at a baseball game. Mm. And they were like because she had someone taking photos of her like sitting up in, in the seats or whatnot. And then the girls behind them were being like hating. Like they were hating on her. Uh. Like they were like flipping off the camera and like laughing at her. And then they were like talking about her and one of the girls pulled out her phone and was like taking a picture of her from behind saying hey. I think I s saw that. Yeah, and I was like, I think this one's right. Yeah, but I don't. Were they really hating? Oh my god. Alright, just. Received. Responding to the situation now. Were they really hating? information, I don't know. Or they come to the app as if it's like a, ther a therapist or something. Like the other day I saw this guy who was like, I'm this is real dead old, sick stuff. I don't have any friends, I live with my parents, I'm so, I hate my life and everything, and I'm like, TikTok isn't gonna save you from that. <sighs> well, you start get, making friends and, or not really making friends, but like, Getting the attention you you, you seek yes. from the nap, yeah. There's a lot of lonely people on this earth, sadly. Out of their bloody...
Listen here. I'm going to tell you something, and it's between you and me. Completely off the record, yeah? The whole thing's quite disturbing to me. They've got good reason to close off parts of the building, but at the end of the day, it's a load of bollocks. This place is a treasured part of London's history, of its culture. Great, powerful men have ruled over this fortress. The citizens of London have an obligation to it. You can't keep people out. They must visit it, breathe in its very essence, so that they too can become great. But again, this is all between you and me, mate. Carry on now. Away for Friday, mate. Simmons, do you know him? Anyway, no matter. He's the one who organised our team building activity. He's rounded up a few of the prisoners they brought in a little while ago. The ones who didn't have any relatives. He figures it'll make for an easier time when we declare them missing. Right. So the fun part. He's going to release them into an open field while we get our shots in. I'll bet you a pint I can get rid of ten before you. <laughs> You're on, you slimy bastard. Listen. Now's your last chance.
Climbing to a high point to unlock icons on a map. How innovative. Feeling somewhat mischievous. You can... <laughs> <laughs> 
Let's clean up this fucking mess. this Templar's day. Be right back.
Ramon. Lucas, fine, fine. Get yourself killed. Let the Templars take you and do whatever they like. I had enough of this. You are being so petulant. I am gonna get out of this bloody city, regroup with the other assassins, and we will reclaim London when the time is right. You're on your own now. Understand, you are on your own. Well done. I'd hate to be that Templar's reconstructive surgeon. Mission. Ask you, see, you don't want to go. I'll go with you if you drive. Well, I don't want to drive. I don't want to drive either.
damn it. City of Longing. Oh my god, what is this thing?
side. But we got our own Starbucks in here now. This game. Lucky for you. I didn't get. I got. But like, Susie, can you, when you get Ethan? It's just because I don't where, feel like driving. Where's my. There it is. The construction. I'll send him an Uber. <laughs> Time you get there is 3 30. Is it? By the time you get there, yeah. Mm -hmm. Are they done for the day or just on lunch? They're probably gonna be done pretty soon. You can do it, you're an adult. It's not about that, it's about just, I don't go leave without. Oh my god. I'll go eat, you suck! You coming? Yeah, I'm coming. Shit! Okay. 